Your Majesty, most gracious, Your Highness. Thank you. Now cut to the chase. What is it? I'm bored and I need something done. Well, there's somebody here to see you. I told you I don't want anybody to see me right now. I am busy. He wants to be a spy. A spy? Well, bring him on in. And remember, tell him not to make me angry. I hope this isn't in the wild, so it's just, it won't be, Your Majesty. Here he is, Your Majesty. Why, hello. Hey, you want to be a spy, Mr. Dandemule, Your Majesty. My name is Dandemule. Well, Dandemule, why would you want to be a spy? It's a very dangerous job. You could be killed. You need a spy, and I think I'm the right one for the job. I will get it done. Simple but elegant. My type of person. Done. Well, come on in. Thank you for joining us, Mr. Dandemule, Your Highness. My name is Dandemule. Well, Dandemule, I'm glad you've joined us. But how do I know you're not a spy? Trust. Trust is hard to have in this war. But for some reason, I do trust you. My gut tells me so. His gut is huge. <laughs> Alfred! Yes, Your Majesty. Take Mr. Dandemule to meet the rest of the team. It is important that he has a good relationship with them if we are to win battles. Of course, Your Highness. And, uh, Alfred. Oh, yes, sir. If anything, anything goes wrong, you will be responsible. If he's a spy, will be executed along with him. Yes, Your Highness. Of course, Your Highness. Come along, Mr. Dandemule. This is our camp. Well, 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 Alfred. She doesn't like you at all. Really? I didn't know. Are you kidding? She's, like, totally in love with you. Now, let's go. This is one of our new recruits who's fallen asleep. This is where you will sleep under here. These are two of our guards. Oh, aerial support, ground crew, water crew, the tree crew is when you saw sleeping. Well, what will I be? I don't know. What are you? Oh, I am a pilot. I fly to see my one true love. Are you kidding? No, not really. I mean, I'm not kidding at all. Uh, I mean, I am kidding. Yes, 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 I'm kidding. I don't have a love on the other side. That would be silly, positively strange. My point exactly. Why, well, the beaver king will be the best king ever. I agree. Now, Alfred, I was wondering, Zoe needed help, and I thought I could help her. Oh, what a good idea. Go along, go along. Who is that? Uh, I haven't learned everybody's names yet. Really? You, the third in command? I'm not third in command. I'm glad she choose you. Because if I fail, you fail. He doesn't like me at all. Oh, I see. Well, Alfred. Alfred, wake up. What? Shh, come on. What do you want? Did you ever feel like you should be on the other side? I thought you said that the beaver king was the best. Did he put you up to this? No. Do you know there's, there's a forbidden prophecy? If it's forbidden, how do you know that? I had a grandmother. Really? She told me the prophecy. Days for forthcoming where three shall climb the doomed mountain and come down again alive and stop the war to bring peace and follow destiny and... What else? What else happened? I don't remember. What? I had just hatched from my egg. And then... <laughs> she died. Oh, my condolences. It was years ago. Now, come on, we need a third one. I know, just the person. What? what? You? Me. Prophecy. One more. Prophecy. We are stopping the war. I don't follow. There's a prophecy. You're part of it. So am I. We're going to get the third person. Let us go. Alfred, you have to stay here. Why? Because you're part of the other camp. These ones might not know that I have left. Oh, I get it. Okay, bye. I see. I see. Yeah. Huh? Uh, Dandemil, what is it? Come on. What? Shh, shh come. Hmm. I wonder what... Oh well. Come on, come on. Uh, why have you brought me to meet one of them? Look, we are part of the prophecy that I told you about. She knows about the prophecy? Yeah. I do. Wait, am I part of it? Yes. Oh, and who's this? My name is Alfred. Oh, hello, Alfredo. Alfred. Alfredo. Nice to see you. Now let's get going. It's Alfred. Nobody knows we're here. We need to have find a camp until morning. Then we'll climb uh, uh, the mountain of death. You figured it out. Good job, Dandemule. 
I was trying to think Mountain of Doom come down alive. Mountain of Death, it's perfect. Come on. Come on, Alfred, Mitzi. We gotta climb the Mountain of Death. Sounds exciting. Sounds like we're all gonna die. I need to rest. Alfredo, why in the world would there be a bench underneath the shadow of the Mountain of Death? Are you seriously, sincerely, and utterly kidding me? It doesn't make any sense. The Mountain of Death doesn't make sense to anybody. It chooses its victims. Oh, boy. We're in trouble. Come on, let's start climbing. Woohoo! Uh, guys, come on, I'm gonna fall down. My claws are the only thing keeping me up here. Whoa! Oh, my goodness. Oh, no! Mitzi, we're coming. We're coming? Who's we? Because it's me. <sighs> no, my scarf! I can't live without my scarf! Oh, no! <sighs> What's this? <gasps> Alfred's scarf! I'm never letting this go! <sighs> my scarf! I'll never live! Why do you like your scarf so much? I don't know. Just kidding! I have to get you guys up here somehow! Come on! Ooh, a platform. Why is there a platform on top of the Mount of Death? Look, if you can have a bench underneath the shadow of the Mount of Death, I can have a platform. So if I need to. He is right. Why is there a cat on the top of the Mount of Death? Damn to real. Stop freaking out. Skin polite. Hello. Hi. What are you doing up here? What are you doing up here? I am Mistress Jenny. I stay up here on this mountain and offer guidance to those who live long enough to get up here. That sounds promising. Anyway, so what do you need? when you live on the top of a mountain. <sighs> See, this is what happens when I don't get to do my musical. All my special props go wet. We're very sorry, but we really need guidance. Follow your heart and your destiny. Wait, we climbed up a mountain of death just to hear that? Yes. Dan Demio, your heart has been hardened. Melted. Mitzi, you are compassionate. And Alfred, I do not know. Follow your destinies, and to me be led. Now go! Go from my sight! Come on, guys. Ah! Oh no! Alfred! Ah! Alfred! No! Alfred! Help! I got you! I got you by the tail! Oh, this is so embarrassing. Alfred! Alfred, no! Stop falling! Ah! Uh! Guys! 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 You are right? You know what, You broke my fall! Gladly. Are you alright, Mitzi? Fine, fine. Now let's go. Let's go. We gotta get and stop everybody from this fighting. But uh, how? We are on different sides of the world. <sighs> I wouldn't do that if I were you. Come on, we can do this. What's your part in this, Dan Demiel? You left Mitzi's side. Uh, uh, uh. It is a secret. Hmm. They could stop the war. The queen could become queen. But I'd rather the beef kick out of the picture completely. I have to kill them. Oh, hello. I'm here to kill you. It's too dangerous for me to keep you alive. Yeah, because of your conspiracy. Oh, so you know. I don't. Care to elaborate? Not really. But when the queen, when Her Majesty the Queen becomes queen, Patricia will soon die, unexpectedly, of course, by me, and then I'll become king. You traitor! Yes, I know. It's so nice, isn't it? We aren't violent people. Oh, we aren't, aren't we? Well, I'll show him to hurt my queen. She'll never believe you. But now she know he knows about us. What are we going to do? Wait, I know. Be right back. All right. Come on. I'll get him. I'll get him. Come on. I'm super strong. Oh, I'm so excited. Oh, mister, wake up. What? Oh, mister, don't worry. Jenny's got you. I will give you guidance. Well, I really have to go. I wouldn't if I were you because you know what you are. The mountain of death. Oh, I really need to get down. But well, don't worry because Jenny's got you. Catsy birds, you know. Oh, boy. Save me, please. Oh, no. Jenny will eat you for dinner. Yum! <laughs> ah! <laughs> uh. <laughs> Jenny loves you.
was doing this. Oh, sir, Jenny's too young to eat a fish diet. Didn't you realize that? <laughs> right, we have to stop this pointless fighting. They'll kill each other. I've been friends with some of these people since childhood. Me too. Yep. You have friends? Nope. Uh, I thought we were your friends. Yep. All right, so somebody needs to go out there and talk to them. I will. Look, people, your fighting is pointless. <sighs> that didn't work. Oh, great. Oh, you go. Everyone, this is pointless. We need to choose a king or a <laughs> Okay, that was fun. Mitzi, why don't you go? Okay. Hope she doesn't die. Oh, no, I can't watch. She's going to get killed. Everyone, look at yourselves. I've been friends with some of you since childhood. Then what are we doing now? Getting ready to kill each other? And what for? This is so pointless. Can't you just open your eyes? How are you being so blind to the fact that we are about to kill each other when the person who started this whole war is here? Queen, I mean Princess Patricia? No. The person, there's a person here who killed the real king and queen. And I'm looking at him right now. Greedy Beaver has killed, what? You killed the rightful king and queen. What? How could you? Patricia is the new queen, which means Greedy Beaver needs to be imprisoned. Imprison him! What? I can't get out! I'm too fast! Save me! Oh no! Help! Now we need to kill the person who, who who's probably trying to kill me. He's the only one in this prophecy who wasn't on my side. Alfredo. It's all the name's Alfred in my prophecy. Time to die. Your Majesty, I never plotted to kill you. I never did. Uh, I can't fly. I can't fly. You never could fly. Anyway, you three will be my new advisors. Thank you so much for all you've done. Well, that turned out nicely. You all right, Alfredo? Yes, Mitzi. Good. Dan Jamil, we did it. Well, we followed our destiny out of our hearts. Yes, and it all worked out. Do, 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 I'm totally going to fight some bad guys with my scarf from my Alfred. Oh no! My Alfred scarf! Hey, my scarf! Guys, look! I found my scarf! I mean, what are the odds? Ooh, Alfredo. Alfredo? I thought you called me Alfredo. Well, that, I can change my mind. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Found my scarf! Found my scarf. All right, we have to stop this pointless fighting. They'll kill each other. I've been friends with some of these people since childhood. Me too. Yep. You have friends? Nope. Uh, I thought we were your friends. Yep. All right, so somebody needs to go out there and talk to them. I will. Look, people. You're... See, why don't you go? Okay. Hope she doesn't die. Oh, no, I can't watch. She's gonna get killed. Everyone. Look at yourselves. I've been friends with some of you since childhood. Then what are we doing now? Getting ready to kill each other? And what for? This is so pointless. Can't you just open your eyes? How are you being so blind to the fact that we are about to kill each other when the person who started this whole war is here? Queen, I mean Princess Patricia? No. The person, there's a person here who killed the real king and queen. And I'm looking at him right now. Greedy Beaver has killed, what? You killed the rightful king and queen. What? I'm with Patricia. Me too. I think all of us are. Yeah, we're ready to go. Uh-huh. How could you? Patricia is the new queen, which means Greedy Beaver needs to be imprisoned. Imprison him! What? I can't get out. I'm too fast. Save me. Oh, no. Help. Alfredo. It's Al the name is Alfred, your majesty. Time to die. No, your majesty. He's the one who tried to kill you, who was plotting against you. Alfred and Dante and I stopped him. What? Your majesty, I never plotted to kill you. I never did. Uh, I can't fly. I can't fly. You never could fly. Anyway. You three will be my new advisors. Thank you so much for all you've done. Well, that turned out nicely. You all right, Alfredo? Yes, Mitzi. Good. Dan Jamil, we did it. Well, we followed our destiny out of our hearts. Yes, and it all worked out. Do, 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 do